Hey guys, it's Rob, and boy do I have a video for you. First of all, I wanted to show you that uh, I've always said that this area here is somehow the underlying process of what created our continents. And the reason why I say that is because of the way it lines up with the continents. Um, but I wanted to focus though also on this pointed area. See how it kind of goes to a point. And I wanted to show you, first of all I'm just going to warm us up with some alignments here. You see this green area right here. You can see that this needs to rotate a little bit, like so. And then you can see that things kind of line up here. See, let me get a one without the highlighted area. I don't like doing highlight. I don't like uh, tracing them because I think it takes away the integrity of the alignment because it's a, uh, you know, it's a copy over, you know, copying over it. See how the, this lines up there? See how they look like a goose's head kind of pointed? It almost tells me that it needs to rotate uh, clockwise. Like that. See how that aligns there? Let's take a step back. This is just the beginning, we're just warming up. See how I can move it over a little bit and then it's, it starts to, the green area fits in right in here. These are different uh, angles, I guess, of Africa. And you can see how it still lines up. That point right here. See how the Red Sea lines up here? And then you can see other things line up too. Like if I back it off this way, you can see how that lines up in there. You can see all kinds of good stuff. How this fits into there. See how this still fits into here. Look at the uh, India. Look how this fits that. Uh, a little strange how this all just kind of fits together, doesn't it? Seem a little bit odd. How this pointy tip fits into there when I bring this simply down. And then this wraps around it. This fitting into, see how these marks fit around? Peninsula of Australia fitting into the Red Sea. This is a. I always said that the uh, the peninsula is related to Florida. And then 
this look at this part right here of Australia is also related to that which is also related to Florida okay but I'm just getting warmed up here notice this point continues to line up even up in here with the features matching here the twisting see how it lines up over and over again Look at how that, yeah, here's that, here's India again. See the, the perfect alignments here. So let me try these other images here. That's my dog. See how that fits into there. See how these are kind of like an opening. Look out. See how the opening drapes kind of fits right in there. Here's uh, Africa. See how that wraps around that point right there. see how this lines up okay let me show you the exactness of these overlays you can see that there's this notch right here when I line it up with this mark right here you can see that there's this clearing and then this narrowing right here. You see this darker area? Look how it fits when I line that up, how it fits in between here and Madagascar. And then you got this uh, what looks like swirling this white area you can see how it fits into here as that first fits in there and then the second one fits there because this is moving See how this fits.
here's another thing. Um, here's India. Doesn't this look like it's being pulled apart and twisted right here? And then, then again, see how it lines up again? Just needs to rotate a little bit, I can tell. But it does fit. this fits Africa see how it fits over and over again just move over a little bit and it fits even again Okay, so Okay, I wanted to take you back to here again How this has got this opening here And how when it's lined up here You can see that fitting the features along with the uh, these dots and stuff seem to be playing into a lot of the images in the background but I wanted to show you something really quick as you got this right here is like the chainsaw I've been talking about Look how that fits right into here I noticed something about this shape right here Reminded me of another shape. Here's Antarctica. Let me get rid of one of these. Here's the mountains in Antarctica. Notice this is the spinning of that peninsula. See how it fits into here? just wanted to point that out for you. See how this fits right in here? Well, that fits into here, even though it's a little different, but it's, it still matches. consider here in the future the twisting now on this one here's that point you'll notice that how this lines up with the green area this thing swoops over but it lines up again when you bring it up in here. It lines up here. It lines up with these images in, on Africa. See the, the roundness. And then you just simply bring it over here and it lines up again and again. See how that here's Italy. Notice how 
notice how the boot right here lines up with the markings. And then as I line this up here, you can see this lines up here. But what's interesting is that this lines up here. So I'm going to take this to a different direction right now. So I want to show you how Africa and this area have to be related. This looks like a vortex to me, and this looks like it's a, an opening. Let's see if I can just line this up right. You can see how it lines up with the green marks and stuff like that. It looks like but it also lines up over here. tell a little bit um, that round area right here it almost looks like it's something folded over Italy Looks like it needs to rotate is what it needs to do, but that's okay. I'm going to move to the next step, which is this. See, I'm moving it over, rotating the planet. Okay, that's going to be part one. Um, part two is going to be coming right out. I just They were just such big files that I had to cut it in half. But part two is going to blow your mind. Um, you got to see it. Thanks for watching.